Hi, welcome to Simple Believer TV. My name is Justin and thank you for, uh, for joining me today as we talk about something that I believe will be extremely helpful in helping you to understand the journey that you're on. Remember this, the destination that God has for us, where we're going, the promised land, so to speak, of our life is not God's primary intention for the journey that you're on. So his main goal is not getting you here. The primary intention of the Father, please hear me when I say these words because I think they can absolutely shift a paradigm inside your life. The main intention of your heavenly Father on the journey that you're on is intimacy with him. Discovering who he is for you and who you are to him. Now let me just clarify that for a moment. You think about it, look at the children of Israel, look at your own life and realize that so often we want this in our life. God, I'm sick, I want healing and God goes, but I wanna be your comforter right now in the situation that you're facing. Yes, I'm your healer, but I, wanna, I want you to discover that I'm also a comforter and so we get so fixated on the end result the destination Lord I'm in need I need provision so I need you to be my provider but he says yes but I also want to be your sustainer right where you're at so that I can teach you how to be a man of peace and a man of joy before you get there and so God's primary intention is not the destination of where he's bringing us to because he's already been there. The primary purpose that God has for us in the journey is to discover who he wants to be for us right now because he wants to answer every area of our life and to discover who we are to him. So as the children of Israel are going through the wilderness and the reason why they went through the wilderness, because if God's primary intention was the destination, they would have taken the land or the route that would have taken them nine to 10 days. But because God wanted an intimate relationship, he wanted to get the, the slave-minded people out of them so that they could become a bride-minded people who are intimate with the Father, he brought them the way of the wilderness so that he could dis so they could discover who God is for us provider uh, he's our our lord jehovah uh, he's going to constantly be there to sustain us to keep us to guide us and also who we are to him we are his bride we are his sons and daughters we are the chosen ones of him so realize on this journey it's about this it's never about this primarily. It's always about your intimacy with the Father because at the end of the day, when you are intimate with your Father, the destination becomes irrelevant because you realized all of life comes down to one thing, knowing God and God knowing us. Have a great day. Thank you for tuning in. Share this with somebody that may be a blessing too. Bye-bye.